Hello everybody and welcome to another tutorial. In today's episode we are going to be talking about the Game Boy Advanced Emulator and how you can enter in game codes. In this example we're going to specifically be talking about Pokemon Emerald. If you notice I have highlighted the master code. When you first start out all of this you have to have the master code enabled and then you can move on to your actual cheat codes that you're wanting to do. I know it looks deceiving, but it's actually all one code. So when you're on your phone, you just simply have to copy it. And if you want the link to this page, I will have it in the description as well. So let's go ahead and hop over to my phone so I can walk you through exactly how it would look when you work through this. And just know that I am using the My Boy app. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and get into the app. So right now the first one that we're going to add is going to be Rare Candies. So if you click the center button it's going to have three lines and you'll notice the fourth menu down is Cheats. When you click on Cheats you'll notice that I already have a couple of codes set in. I'll go ahead and let you look at the master set since we talked about it earlier and that's what you need to type in. So you'll notice that here's where I typed it in. And it is in two lines, so don't worry about that. And then you can name it whatever you want. I just left it as master set just so I know, hey, this is the, uh, the master code. So if you notice in the top right, there's going to be a little plus sign. So what that means is that's just adding a new cheat. So what we want to do is go ahead and add in the cheat code. And I have it copied already for the rare candies. So we've got that in there. And then cheat name, we're just going to name it what it is. Trust me, for organizational purposes, you're really going to want to do this. So we've got ran, uh, Rare Candy in there. And then for the cheat type, I have been informed that you need to use Code Breaker. So now that that is there, we want to make sure to save it. And you want to make sure that it's checked. If it's checked, that means it's enabled and you can actually use it. If you notice, everything's in blue right now, so we're good. So then you just have to walk around for a little bit. When you're talking about these items that you can, you know, do some type of purchasing with, what you're going to do is go to the Pokemart and then just go up to the counter. When you go up to the counter, you're going to say, hey, I want to buy something. But notice this. This is absolutely incredible and just super genius. Where it says Great Ball, if you look off to the left side of the screen, you're going to see the little piece of candy. And what is that little piece of candy actually? Well, it's the rare candy. So what it does is it's disguised in the list as something else. And all you have to do is just purchase it a bunch of times. And then you can get as many rare candies as you want. I would recommend you to go near the start of the game where all of the items are cheaper. Because if you notice, I'm a little further on in the region and the first option is the Great Ball and it's 4,800, you know, currency or whatever. You don't want to do that. You want to get something super cheap to get it to pop up. So definitely take my advice and go towards the beginning of the game. Well, that's really all there is to it and I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you have a lot of fun and just get out there and catch them all, use some rare candies, just have fun with it. That's what these cheat codes are all about.